In this video, we'll show you how to use the Wigovi Flex Touch Pen. Always read the instructions for use in the Wigovi Patient Information Leaflet before you use your pen. Each Wigovi pack comes with one pen, four needles, and a patient information leaflet like you see here. You will use one pen each month. Each pen contains four doses, which are injected once weekly. We'll talk more about the dosing later in the video. Now let's unbox the Wigovi. You'll need your pen, needles and leaflet, soap and water or an alcohol wipe, plaster or gauze, a sharp spin, a pen cycle box. This is for your final dose of this pen. First take the pen out of the box and make sure that the pen label says Wagovi and the dose matches what you've been prescribed. Do not use it if the pen appears to have been used or is broken, and don't use it if the expiration date on the back of the pen has passed. Pull the pen cap off. Look through the pen window and check the solution is clear and colourless. Do not use the pen if Wigovi is cloudy or coloured. Take one of the needles from in the box and take off the seal. Push the needle straight into the pen, twisting until it is firmly in place. Pull off the outer needle cap and save this for later. You'll need it to safely remove the needle from the pen after injection. Inside you'll see a smaller inner needle cap covering the needle. Pull off the inner needle cap and discard it. Before your first injection with a new pen, we need to check that the treatment flows. You can do this by turning the flow selector until you see the flow check symbol. Now hold the pen with the needle pointing up. Press and hold the dose button until the dose counter returns to zero. A drop should appear on the tip of the needle. The drop indicates that the pen is ready to use. Now you can turn the dose selector and prepare for an injection. Do this by turning the dose selector until the prescribed dose appears in the window. You can inject Wagovi in your upper arm, stomach or thigh. If you inject in your stomach, keep it two inches away from your belly button. You can inject in the same part of your body each week, but make sure it is not the exact same spot each time. Don't inject in an area where the skin is tender, bruised, red, warm or hard, or areas with scars or stretch marks. Wash your hands, then make sure to clean the injection site with soap and water or an alcohol swab. And do not touch the area after cleaning. When you are ready to inject, insert the needle into the skin. Make sure you can see the dose counter. Press and hold the dose button until the dose selector says zero and you hear a click. Continue to hold the dose button in and count to six to make sure the dose is fully delivered. Then carefully remove the needle from the skin and prepare to dispose of the needle. Always remove the needle after use. Place the outer needle cap on firmly and unscrew the needle. Put the pen cap back on the pen for the next dose. 
If blood appears at the injection site, press lightly with a gauze pad or cotton ball and apply a plaster if desired. Throw the needle into a sharps disposal container, never in your household trash. An unopened flex touch pen should be stored in the original box and kept cold in the fridge. Do not freeze the pen. Once open, your pen can be stored in the fridge or at room temperature for up to six weeks in the original box. Keep the pen and needles out of sight and out of reach of children. Handle the pen with care. Do not expose your pen to dust, dirt or chemicals. Any damage can lead to an inaccurate dosing. Once your pen is empty, you can pop it in a pen cycle box for recycling. Use the same pen for all four weekly injections, but you must change the needle each time. Start with Govi with a dose of 0.25 mg once per week in your first month. You stay on each dose for at least four weeks. Each dose has its own colour, so you can make sure you're using the correct dose each week. In your fifth month, you'll increase your weekly dose to 2.4 mg. From then onward, you'll continue taking that dose each week. You'll check in with us when requesting your next dose so we can track what's working for you and when you're ready to fill your next dose.